Hey friends. Hello friends. Hello friends. Yeah. Thank you. We are at the French Quarter because we're doing a little pumpkin hunt. We brought Brandon because he actually knows where all the pumpkins are already. Yeah. I have a head start. You know, I was sitting here. Yeah. It out. So he's like a you know pumpkin expert. Gonna... And here is the French Quarter pumpkin patch scavenger hunt. 13 of Disney's most mischievous. 13 of Disney's most mischievous villains have taken over Disney's Port Orleans. Do you guys hear Yip correcting me in the background back there? No, go with the address. I like it. <laughs> so we gotta find them, name the villain, name the location, and then turn in this paper, paper for a prize. Everyone is making fun of me because I'm stumbling upon my words. <laughs> the paper paper. <laughs> my words. Let's do this. And I, there is no way that I am actually going to be writing this stuff out. I'll write it. Okay. I'm you, really excited for this. You are I in charge of the pumpkin just, list. I'm never really um, focused when I'm in a gift shop. I know. But, but I'm here now. we are at the French Quarter, so you know what that means? Gumbo Jumbo. Yep. I'm getting some gumbo and jambalaya right after this pumpkin hunt. Mm -hmm. If you're looking to get a pumpkin patch scavenger uh, sheet, you need to go into the gift shop to the left in the main lobby. That's where they have them. But once you get done with it, you have to take it up to the front desk because that's where you claim your prize. So we're going to get this going right now. But on the way in, I already spotted one pumpkin and I know who that villain is. And of course, major spoilers because we're going to show you where all the pumpkins are. Right there, as soon as you walk in. Look at that, it's Jafar. Ha, Jafar. Who is your favorite villain? Mine has gotta be Oogie Boogie or Hades. So, I found one, Jafar, in the lobby. I honestly think Brandon pointed that out to you. Yes, Brandon, the pumpkin expert actually. There's another one over there too, just in case you're wondering. Oh, <laughs> this is, uh. <laughs> Oh, and uh, Brandon pointed out, right inside the scat club here, who do you think that is? You might say, it's me. It is you! You're not a villain, though. No, I'm just not a pumpkin. Uh, oh, oh. I'm gonna guess Gaston. And I don't think I need to guess. I think I know it's Gaston. <laughs> Veronica just stumbled upon something. There's actual riddles for each one. Okay, this one, he was searching for a genie to grant him so much more he can be found when you walk through the doors. That's oh, obviously Jafar. Yep, and Jafar. Lobby. Lobby. So they give you a little clue and a little riddle. Oh, I liked it. They actually have a stage here. So they have live entertainment that happens here at night or during the day. Thanks, <laughs> to the hunt. I answered number two. Number two. Is it true that no one can drink like this villain? He can be found where the cool cats are chilling. <laughs> Gaston. Oh wait, we're the cool cats. Hey, you know where we could find some pumpkins? Huh? <laughs> Let me whisper in your ear. You. He doesn't even have an ear. If alligators don't have ears, how are they here? That's what Yip just said. Brandon said with their tongue. Oh, with their tongues. <laughs> That's only snakes. So basically, we're on our way over to the free boat rides because one of the riddles is directing us oh. to what? there. What? Hey, you guys doing the pumpkin scavenger hunt? We are, we're really bad at it. Yeah, very I feel good. the same way. Very good, very good. Very good. Very good. Brandon, the pumpkin expert, has found the Yzma. Should we say the pumpkin king? The pumpkin, <laughs> the king. pumpkin king. Yzma. All right, give us a clue. Which direction are we going? A prison of thorns is what this mistress of evil intended. She's hiding from you in branches where the movies are splendid. Oh wow, you know, you have a really good story time voice. 
Singing bye bye Miss American Pie Do your laundry on the levee cause that's where it dries Well we made it to the place where movies under the stars happens And I already spot the pumpkin Do you pumpkin king? Hold on, hold on, hold on Yes! It's, it's in the tree! <laughs> where? Right here! Right there! But I'm colorblind, I couldn't see that. <laughs> now who is this? Malficent! Uh-oh, don't say it wrong. Malficent. <laughs> Guys, quick, quick, quick! Is there one about roasting marshmallows on there? Because I think I see a pumpkin in the tree by the fire pit. Let's see. Can well, I you can find it. Relax by the fire! <laughs> oh, relax by the fire! Oh wow, look! There it is, hanging in the tree. Oh, what's his name? It's Dr. Facilier. It is Dr. Facilier. We were gonna see what Nate came <laughs> What? <laughs> were you trying to get me to pronounce it wrong? No. <laughs> Dr. Felicity. 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 Dr. Felicity. I know who Dr. Felicier is. Facilier? Yes. One of my favorite things about this resort is like this walkway here to get to your room. Like I love how they have this little arch with the trees. Little things like that really make a resort. Sorry, off subject, but I had to point it out because they're over there talking about how to pronounce Dr. Facilier right because I pronounced it wrong. We ducked inside to get away from the heat, but not to get jambalaya and gumbo at the moment. We gotta finish the scavenger hunt first, and then it's jumbo. Jumbo? Yeah, I mix my gumbo with my jambalaya, and I make jumbo. Or gumbalaya. Yeah, he's hilarious. Hades is my favorite. <laughs> yes. I literally said at the beginning of the video, my two favorite is Hades and Oogie Boogie, and I hope I got to see them. And guess what? The there he is. What are your two favorites? Hades. There is and my man. Dr. So. Wow. <laughs> Inception. His favorite oh. is your favorite. Your favorite is my favorite. Like and your other favorite is my favorite. This is a villainous favorites. We aspire to perspire. <laughs> so we actually found Hades without reading the clue. Because that's how Just good that the Pumpkin good. King is. <laughs> what is the question? His throne in the underworld was certainly dreary. This villain can be found where foods are most cheery. Ooh, ah. Okay, we've got this accomplished. Did anybody else think these were doors? No, because there's <laughs> tables in the way. I literally almost just walked out that door. Oh, I wish. And that's a pretty light fixture. Okay, we got one more in the gift shop where we started and we didn't catch it. Hey! <laughs> We missed one. Give us a clue, eh? Okay, so it is technically inside. Have a good day, guys. Thanks. It is technically not inside the oh. store, but it is not outside of the store. Must be out there. That is very clever. Huh. Let's see if he was right. Where's the pumpkin? Oh. Is it in the glass? It's in the glass, isn't oh, it? Ah! Is wow, one. that was this tricky. Was a good one. Thanks to Paul over there, he gave me the two finger <laughs> point in the right direction. <laughs> <laughs> right there. Who is it? Mickey. That's not Mickey. The evil Queen. Right there. It's the Evil Queen. Let's head to the arcade because something tells me. There's got to be one in here. You seen a pumpkin in here? No. No. Ooh, that's a basketball, not a pumpkin. <laughs> there it is, actually. <laughs> Oogie Boogie. Ooh, she's doing good, but it is the man himself. Oh. Oogie Boogie. Oh. Cause I'm the boogeyman. Well, I figure this makes sense. Um, well, we didn't read any more riddles, did we? But no. if we went to the middle, to the left, back up to the lobby, in the restaurant, in the gift shop, probably to the right, 
they'll have a pumpkin over here. Okay. Oh, it's Scar. Is it Scar? It's really Scar. Yeah. It doesn't look like a lion. When he took the pride lens, this lion shouted, hooray. This villain can be found where you run for beignets. Wait, oh. when did Scar Oh, I can see the Scar. The Lion King. He did. The Scar never said hooray. <laughs> Wait, he, he... Oh, when you forget that there's a zoom on. Hooray for the death of the king. Why, is he sick? Oh, he did say hooray. Yeah. So it was really hard to find the Scar one, actually. And the riddle said that Scar says hooray. And we were like, huh. When, when has Scar ever said hooray? But that being Veronica's favorite movie, she literally quoted out one time Scar said hooray in Lion for King. For the death of the king. Hooray for the death of the king. She's a Lion King nut. We picked a very hot day to actually come out here and trunch around French Quarter. It is like what? It's in the 90s, isn't it? No, this is really, really nice Ooh. day. There's no humidity. It's nice, but I it's just, that, bam. I think that when they planned this, they said, oh, it's going to be like a nice, it's a fall activity. They don't care walking around, but they forgot that it's yeah. still like summer. It's still summer. But if you are going to do this, I suggest you just start in one section and then walk and uh, go in a big circle. Because if you go by the list, it'll have you bounce back and forth. Like it'll have... You start out in the lobby, go all the way back to the boat loading dock, back to the lobby. Like, that's how it goes, one, two, and three. So we're trying a different approach where we actually just walk around a big circle and try to spot them out with our bare eye. Bare eye? Bare eye! Oh, Lady Tremaine? Lady Tremaine! We had to go back to the laundry room, you know, the laundry on the levee, because... We're too busy with the song. Yeah. We totally forgot about the pumpkin. We got just too worked up with the levee. And I'm hope I'm saying levee right because levy. I'm sh Levy. Thank you. Brandon, I have a riddle for you. Yes. I got you a present that you cannot refuse. But is that the pumpkin under that jester's shoes? <laughs> is that a good one? That, that was a good one, but I have to refuse the oh. present. Oh, all right. Oh we God. were walking oh. all over the pool and look at that, it's right there. Who is it though? The sea witch! Thank you sir! We have found the pumpkin! <laughs> How many do we have left guys? Two! Two! Two. And they're all in this general direction? Yes. Alright, sounds good. Oh, I spotted one! Oh yeah. I can't one. see it from here. Who is it? Captain Hook. It is Captain Hook! I know that waist from anywhere. You know that waist? <laughs> <laughs> I know that waistline from anywhere. I'm using my magical towel to uh, get some of the... Uh... This is why I don't wear makeup. Oh. oh, that's why. We have one more pumpkin and then it's gumbalaya time. <laughs> we gotta get to that pumpkin. Are you gonna have enough time? Oh yeah. Alright. Oh my goodness. And the very last pumpkin on the list, number 13, is actually at the bus depot, the farthest away. Hey, this is the most important one. Let me know. It's Corella Deville. I don't like her. Veronica's staying back there <laughs> because she doesn't like Corella Deville. But we already spotted it, so we want to get a good look at it. There it is. Corella Deville. We have completed the pumpkin challenge. We have done it. Yes. We did it. We did it! Thank you. Let's go get our prize. Let's go. We are coming to claim our prize. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. We have completed this hunt for the pumpkins. Look at Brandon compared to mine. Why is yours so wrinkled? Because I'm not carrying like 20 things. You are. You're carrying most of her stuff. Three. Ooh. Wow. Let's see it. Look at this. Wow. That is an awesome pen. Right? This is an award we worked very hard for, and we should be rewarded by getting some gumbalaya. This is not my sheet. I'm going straight there. 
What was that? Champions! We did it. Thank and as you. As a prize, they give you Dumbo. And my gumbalaya. Look at that. A little bit of jambalaya, a little bit of white rice, and my gumbo soup all mixed together. Mm-hmm. Okay, Shushu. Go make some magic. Go make some magic. Make magic. He's gotta go to work at the Magic Kingdom tonight. I feel bad. Every time we hang out, I end up uh, getting him full of food before he actually has to go to work. All right, that's that. It was really fun. Yep. Now I'm full on my gumbalaya. I had a lot of fun playing the pumpkin game. The pumpkin game. The great pumpkin. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Love the life you live. Love the life you live. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah. Thank, thank you for traveling with us.